This 14-time All-Star from the Cleveland Cavaliers was a four-time Kia NBA MVP. He also makes everyone on this team wear name tags because they all knew. I'm talking about the captain of the East, LeBron James. Off the steal, this is DeRozan of the Raptors. Oh, knocked away by LeBron. Fence for a portion of the game. Well, Dwayne Casey can talk all he wants. I think the biggest voice there, nice bounce pass from LeBron to AD. How about the bounce pass here? LeBron James to the unibrow AD. He used to see our own Isaiah Tushins, Carl Anthony Towns, Draymond Green, Clay Thompson have just and we just saw a block shot. <laughs> Kyle Lowry was turned back. James, a beautiful pass. Clay Thompson having a terrific season. Leads the NBA, shooting 45% from three-point range. LeBron off the face. It's the goal team for the for the Warriors. Nice pass, dump down from LeBron. And how about the three little pump fake? Draymond runs oh, by, resets himself. Red. One dribble, bottoms. Three-point attempt missed. And LeBron has Walker ahead of the field. Gave it up, and it's back to James. We are early second quarter. Marv Albert, Chris Webber, Reggie Miller. There's James. Yes. And this is Kimber Walker saying, see, if I would have got played with you, but this is what I do to the big fella Howard and back in Charlotte. And there's that jab step that I'm talking about that I think LeBron loves to kind of rock you to sleep, see if you're going to come out because he can drive by you. Get his rhythm and knock it down from deep. Way to flip Saunders' legacy found. Now the shoes today have the theme from the cartoon Rick and Morty. 40, but how about taking flight here? LeBron James with the reverse. Look at the head. Are you kidding me? 14th season and his head is on the rim, C-Web. Are you kidding me? It has been such a close game. I caught up with head coach Dwayne Casey, the coach of Team LeBron at halftime. I asked him how much this game means to them as Anthony Davis gets it done. All right, thank you, David. Jimmy Butler yet to play in the game. Here's LeBron taking all the way and went to the left hand. This is why I want to see defense. Because the more you challenge these great oh, players, man. the more special oh, their moves are. You <laughs> see what I'm saying? <laughs> yes. Steph agrees with me. He is impressed. That impresses the Stephster. Embiid. And here's LeBron with an emphatic stuff. James with a beautiful look away pass. Timeout taken by Mike Dan expressed that James and Durant and others in the league are certainly free to express their political opinion. LeBron who may well be the front runner. 21 points, including three from downtown, 10 rebounds, six to six. In fact, he just passed a fellow by the name of Oscar Robinson for fifth in all-star history in terms of assists. That went back rim. Back comes Durant. Irving. Nice pass. Wow. Yes. Here and the comes. foul. Here comes Team LeBron. You had a flare screen three for Paul George by LeBron. Guard through center, but Embiid having his way in that painted area on offense. See, this is where LeBron has the advantage yes. now with Embiid trying to guard him out on the, on the floor. For free and Right there, LeBron right back James at you. From downtown has tied it at 144. LeBron James trying to go for his LeBron, third All Star MVP. Team Steph going right back at him to their advantage in the post. Harden takes the inbounds. Well, clearly they didn't take Heights' view from the baseline. Harden fires and comes up short. Joel Embiid. Westbrook putting moves on to Rosen. And so the time scores. And this one leads by one.
It's our defense that made this happen. They were challenged. They had to move the ball and go back to basic basketball. Uh, neither club has shot well from three-point range. Now to five seconds. Curry looking for the three. Curry double team. Curry can't find it. Now does, and that will do it. And Team LeBron off the bench. A happy group. <laughs> But of course, tonight there can only be one MVP, and that is LeBron James. All right, Captain LeBron, you know what this feels like to be standing here at the All Star game and to hold that trophy. This is the third time you've done it and also 14 straight starts. How different, though, was this one? Because it certainly had a different feel to it. Uh, I think uh, myself and Steph, we took it upon ourselves when we decided to do this format that we had to change the landscape of how the All-Star game was played. The last couple of years, it wasn't as, as competitive as we would like. So as you can hear in my voice, you know, that tells how competitive it was, and it was great from both sides. Uh, what were the chances that a defensive stop <laughs> would determine the winner of an All-Star game? Uh, the chances are very slim in an all-star game, that's for sure. But uh, we, that's something we wanted to do uh, tonight, have the defense uh, be a little bit more of an emphasis going into this game. And you saw it all the way down to the last possession. No, I, I rarely do you see in an all-star game uh, Dwayne Casey, one of the coaches, at half court in defensive position. You arguing for the use of replay and saying they got it wrong. I mean, this, this had a, a little more intense feel to it. I, I had a real game feel to it. And it starts with us. All these guys right here, these guys came in with the right mindset this, uh, this weekend. And we wanted to give our beautiful fans and our beautiful game played in over 200 countries in the world a show. And uh, we said we wanted to do it, and we, we came out, and, and we did that. So, I mean, we got the best league in the world, and we want to continue to do that every single day. No question. It was a great night, great basketball, really fun to watch. And this is, this is LeBron James, who is once again the MVP of the NBA All-Star Game, third time.